Hello everyone, this is Paul from HiFiMate. In today's video, I want to talking about how to make the setting for the Mercedes-Benz Android screen. Now, I will talking about how to set the audio for the Android screen. You need to go to the setting and system and scroll down, choose IUX position here. IUX position 1, you need to go to the original car menu, main menu, and you will find the audio position in the menu. For example, if the audio in the second position, you can set to the 2 here in this setting, set to 2. And the second one, how to set it? You can go to the original audio and in the submenu, you will see there's IUX here. In the IUX, you can call from the first one. For example, if the IUX in the sixth position, you can set to the sixth. If that is in the seventh position, you need to set the IUX position 2 as 7 here. The second thing is go to the factory setup menu. Click vehicle here. IUX switching mode chose automatically here. And IUX auto switching, you need to choose other. This is for NTG 4.5 or NTG 4.7 model. If your car is NTG 4.0, that is manual switching. It don't support automatically switching. Please notice this. And another thing you can check is the warrant here. Media call here the warrant here to set to higher warrant level. Also, click Android and click Show here. You need to set the setting to maximum. But if there's no sound when you're playing the music in the Android side, there's no sound in the speakers, you have to check you need to move the optical fiber cable to Android power cable in the same spot. Only that, it have the sound. Some friends ask me if the original menu, it don't have IUX, how to do it? Here, go to the setting, factory. Here, and vehicle. Here, IUX activate. You need to choose this. Choose this. After that, it will restart the car. Then you can check the OEM menu. Under that audio, it will have IUX in the menu. That way, you can go to the system to set the IUX position here. Here. This is the way to activate the IUX in the original menu here. In this part, I will be talking about how to set the CAN protocol. Go to the setting and factory. Here. CAN protocol here. When your car is NTG 4.5, you should choose this one here. And the next part is how to choose the car display. Car display setting is enable original menu display on the Android side when you hit the 
car infant here to show the original car menu here. So you can make a setting here. Go to the factory and car display here. You should choose the model based on your car type. For example, your car is NTG 4.5. This is the resolution. 5.8 is the screen size for the original display here. You can choose this one. And back to the main menu, click the car infant. It will, it will show the original menu in the Android side here. If that's not correct, then you can try another one, this one. NTG 4.0 to 4.5 here. Here. Uh, 800 by 418. This is the resolution for the original display. 7 inch is the original display. Here. You can try this one. And also can try this one. This one. Here. Here is the MICK. When you make a calling, if you feel the Bluetooth is so low, the other people cannot hear you. So you need to check the MICK here to set to the high level for the MIC here. About the camera here in Sixton, camera selection here. If your car have the original backup camera, you should show OEM camera here. If you install the aftermarket backup camera, you should show aftermarket camera here. That way, the camera will work when you reverse the gear to the to the reverse mode.